morning. I'm Eric Ramirez, and today I will be talking about recess and the and within elementary schools within the state of Florida. Recently, within the state of Florida, elementary schools have either reduced or eliminated the time of recess. Due to this, there has been a negative impact to many students physically and mentally to focus like, their ability on school. According to should elementary schools have red recess, some Florida parents fight for break by Chris Circle Brunson. Brunson says many teachers are using that extra 20 minutes that would have been spent on the playground at recess in order to teach the test. As shown in the image, standardized tests are being uh, are being implemented much more throughout the re these recent years, which uh, without and not providing enough recess, causing low ability to focus in class with all the jitters from students not being able to get all their energy, especially with uh, kids growing, they need to get their daily exercise. With elementary school is not providing enough recess, it, it is harming students both mentally and physically. But with the implementation of recess, of more recess time, the future of students' ability to focus in class and future health will be impacted in a, uh, in a beneficial way. First of all, the elementary schools are just not providing enough, enough recess. According to a study conducted at Leeds Becker University by Dr. Joanne Trigwell, children and young people engage in at least 60 minutes of moderate to vigorous physical activity per day, vigorous intensity activities at least three days per week. That, if students are only give 20 minutes or less of recess throughout their day over a five day period, which is a week, it only adds up to 100 minutes per week as shown in my uh, chart. But, and they need a minimum of at least 180 minutes, which comes to show that if they don't even, they only receive about almost a half of what they actually need to maintain a healthy lifestyle. One of the leading health issues right now in elementary school students is obesity. Obesity comes from a lack of exercise and a lack of burning calories and unhealthy diets. Uh, in the near future for elementary schoolers coming, other uh, illnesses that will pop up are diabetes, high blood pressure, cancer, and many more illnesses. Additionally, in Why Kids Need Recess uh, Experiment uh, by Alia Wong. Uh, in one series of experiments, researchers manipulated recess start times. Some days children were let out at 10 a.m. and the other days at 10.30. The kids' attentiveness decreased when they had to wait longer for recess and rebound, uh, rebounded after they played. If, more, if recess time is actually implemented and it implemented for a much longer period of time, students' ability to focus in class will be will be boosted and their cognition mentally will have will, will make them cause a uh, better focus. But this is not all the school's fault. This can also become the parents' fault. According to a study conducted at least Becky University by Dr. Joanne Trigwell, in all ethnic groups, parents considered that physical activity children did at school during physical education classes at break time and then and when walking to and from school would fulfill the recommendation and they therefore did not always see a need to encourage their children to be active out of school hours. What is so what does this mean? This means that children are receiving little to no exercise at all throughout their day if elementary schools do not provide recess. On the contrary, many on the contrary, many would say that parents should be obligated to give uh, make their uh, kids participate in extracurricular activities, but that could also not be true because there are so many sources nowadays that helps that says so many different information that they don't really know what to believe or what not to believe. In essence, there are many uh, solutions to help fix this current issue. First solution is assuring recess time and, and, and just making sure that re students receive recess time and making it for a long period of time 
or overall just just um, giving short amounts of recess and multiple sessions. Thank you. We'll question to you. I have two questions I have for you. First up, what evidence did you gather that you didn't use? Um, the evidence that I gathered was I had evidential support for my uh, for my rebuttal or my counterclaim, but I did not end up using it due to time. It would, be, it would have been too long. Uh, and next question. What advice would you have for other researchers that want to research this particular topic? I would advise that they make sure they search, they look more into statistics and charts because for students' ability to focus in class because it was very difficult to find even using all these advanced um, browsers. All right, thank you.